though everybody else and their dog is going to be doing Lady Gaga this Halloween, I thought I would do a little Lady Gaga for this Halloween. Now I'm not going to take any specific look that she's ever done, I'm going to do more of a what Lady Gaga would do kind of look. And it's going to be a rainbow smoky eye, if I can pull this off. I just thought of it in my head just now, and um, we'll see. This entire eye makeup look is going to be done using Calypso Minerals. Okay, let's get primed and ready with a little Urban Decay Primer Potion. In all honesty, I haven't really thought this out much. I just, I'm gonna kinda go with it here. Hopefully that turns out okay. Let's start out with the lightest at the top, shall we? So I'm going to use Kryptonite, which is a white, with green duo shimmer in it. Okay, now we're going to go in with Lemon Sorbet. little bit of Orange Crush, which is the orange. I will blend them out more here in just a minute. Okay, now we're going to move on to Razzle Dazzle, which is a kind of a magenta color, a raspberry. Next up we have Grape Pop. Now, during your blend, you're going to start to lose individual colors, and they're all going to kind of come into one. Um, so that's okay. That's really, we're just going for kind of a gradient effect. So it's going to just kind of go down to the darkest point from the lightest to the darkest and kind of blend into each. So next, we're moving on to True Blue. And this whole time, I'm using the same brush. This is a... Um, Low, cor low Cornell Mini Mop. Uh, it's one and a quarter. Or, I'm sorry, it's a one quarter inch. So, um, and then after I apply most of the color, I just wipe it off real quick dry so it still has some color retaining on there, and then I'll blend it out. Is the black. Now, this black is called Jet Black. It's a matte black. Okay, I mixed in a little mixing medium in with the black. So now I'm just going to. I'm applying it there at the bottom. I, I did get a little messy on it, but it's alright because I'm going to blend it. Now back with an, in with our blender brush. Okay, now I definitely have a lot of fallout, fallout but that's because I used a really fluffy brush that carried too much pigment probably, but it worked really well for my blending, so you just have to kind of deal with the consequences. That's why wet wipes are the best. It calls for a little bit of liner, so I'm going to use the Urban Decay um, Ink for Eyes. And to kind of bring it around here to a close, I'm going to take my Sephora eye pencil, um, what color, this is 504, it's a light purple, and just kind of drag it over where I ended. And that's going to give the rest of the pigments that I'm going to use something to stick to. Up with In the Navy, again Calypso Minerals, it's navy. I'm going to start like right here where the black ends. Same brush, just wipe off a little bit. Now we're going to go to Matte Violet. Then we're going with Envious. 
And finally, we're going to tie it all together with um, kryptonite again, which is what we started up here at the top. I'm going to finish up my waterline with a little black um, cold pencil. I decided I wasn't really all that happy with my little line here, so I've just been blending it out to make a more dramatic line on this other side. Okay, as you can see, I filled in my eyebrows real quick, and now I'm going to go in with one of my new favorite blushes. It is awesome. It's called Doll Face by Beauty From The Earth. It's this really bright, vibrant pink, and not in like a fake way. It's like a, well, like a doll. So we're going to go kind of round-shaped here. We'll blend it out a little bit. Now mascara, I'm going to use Smashbox uh, Bionic Mascara. If I had false lashes, I'd be putting those on right now. That's definitely a Gaga wear. For my lips here, I've just mixed a little strawberry in with a gloss on the back of my hand so that I have a gloss. And strawberry is from uh, Beauty From The Earth. 